When you watch him, you can line him up anywhere. Here he is over the right tackle of the Giants. See, I want everybody to feel his punch. Because when I talk to players in this league, one of the guys they say that's the most powerful player that they go against is Kinlaw. Like, watch what he does to the right guard here of the Jets, Van Roten. Like, he backs him up three yards. Then get off the block and go make the play. Now, he's going to get Boza back this year. You watch his power, right? Watch him read the choke block here. See this? That's awesome. That ability to read it, get back inside, and then make the play. All right? Like, he, he's got some recognition now. Now, here he is on top of the center. All right? Let him go everywhere. Let him feel the punch. Let him feel the power. That's a quick escape. That's beautiful. Right there. Quick escape. All right, now flatten. That's a nice job. Nice effort. Effort? You want to see effort? This is effort. This is what I want to see. Because good things happen. You get 99 and 97 and 91 chasing like this. It's a beautiful thing. All right, good things are going to happen. Ball's going to come out. Like sideline to sideline. That's 49er football. All right, you watch him here against Easton, right? Now, he's going to get pulled and jerked right here. But look at the athletic ability. Stay on his feet and get to Taysom Hill and to get him down. Athletic ability. But he's got unusual power. Now, you combine that power with recognition. All right, now this is a play between Kevin Gibbons, all right, who I love out of Penn State, free agent, splits that double team right here, going to come in and put a hit on Goff. This is the highlight reel of Javon Kinlaw last year. Division game. Like this guy, it's not even a breakout star. It's just a development that I expect to see from him. And you line him up, up to 97, team's going to have a problem. It's going to be a problem. 